Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you haven't been here before, welcome. So today I'm going to show you guys how to customize a lace frontal. So what I'm starting with is I'm using the Powdered Bleach by Clairol 30 Developer. You need an applicator container and the brushes. So what you want to do is what I use is two scoops, two and a half scoops. And I just pour in the developer slowly and then I mix it. What you want to get is a very thick consistency that doesn't drop off the brush. That's the key because you do not want the bleach to seep through the lace. So once that's done, you slowly would begin painting it on. Sorry, the frontal was bent and I had to just tape it down to the table. So here we go. So what you want to do is you want to take a thick layer and slowly brush it on because you do not want it to seep through the lace. So let's brush that all on and then we'll move over to the next step. Okay, so at the end, this is what your frontal should look like. It should be a very thick layer on top of the frontal. And then once that's done, what I do is I just flip it over so that I can watch to make sure the knots are being bleached. So once you flip it over, you want to make sure you're watching closely. I'm going to try to zoom in, but I also use my cell phone for better footage so that you guys can see. Do you see the little black dots? You just want to make sure before you wash up the bleach that those turn blonde, like those are bleached. Not the hair, those little dots you see. So with my phone, I zoomed in so you guys can catch a better view. So as you can see, slowly the dots are changing into blonde. Okay, so for the next step, with plucking, I already plucked mine already because my camera died last night and I had to get it done because I pluck while it's wet. But what you want to do is you want to lightly pull the strands. And I don't ever pluck from the front. I always pluck from the middle and pull it back. And you want to pinch and have very, very light hands when you're doing that. What I also do is, because sometimes the frontals come pre-plucked, I part the front out and push it forward and then pluck from the middle onwards and pull it back. So when you're pulling and plucking, you want to pluck to in a pulling backwards motion. You don't want to pluck upward because you'll give yourself bald spots. So as you're pulling back, you're, there's multiple strands coming out at once. And that's the goal that you want to have. Because I did my baby hairs off camera, I just was going to give you guys what I use to create baby hairs and what I use to lay them down. So I use olive oil mousse along with got to be, I use the yellow bottle. I just feel like it keeps it down a lot easier. Um, um, okay, so once you do that, and now that the frontal is bleached and everything, this is what it should look like. if. Only the knots are bleached. It should not be on the hair at all. So I thought I'd give you guys just a quick little design, I guess you want to call it, a quick little hairstyle that I just decided to do to the frontal for now. So I just put two braids in the top and just curled it all up. And stay tuned to watch that if you guys are interested. And this is the final look so I hope you guys enjoyed if you have any questions in terms of customizing a frontal 
put it down in the comment box below and I hope to see you guys on my next video and don't forget to subscribe thanks again